Hello. Hold on a second. Um, I'm about to go live. Hello, everyone. My arena's not showing up. Okay. We are going to fix it. Don't worry. I'm, I'm here with my Robin Hood outfit on for the Early Access event. Hi, everyone. How's it going today? Thanks, Scary Gary P, for the follow. I really appreciate it. Let me get my arena up here. Um, is it gonna show up? There it is. Yay! Okay, I've got some decks ready to play, and we're gonna do it. We're going to play some decks. So, how's everyone doing today? I'm doing just fine. I'm doing great. <laughs> Fixing arena hype. Yes, fix arena. I got it. Here we go. So, let me show you all some of the decks that I have to play. Um, okay, so I have... Okay, this one's called Sactos Agro. Um, as you can tell, it's a Rakdos deck. And there's a lot of second creatures. So it's called Sactos Agro. I think that one will be fun. Um, here's a mono black one with a uh, Rankle Master of Pranks in it. I'm really kind of excited to play that card. So I think, I think that one will be pretty fun. Um, I have another one, and I found all of these decks on Aether Hub, so that's where they've all come from. If, if you all like them and want to try them, that's where they're at. This one is called Fast Food. It's um, obviously about making food tokens, so I think that one looked really fun. Um, and then I've got Redheads, this Decimana Red deck, Mardu Knights. I'm really excited about the, the Knights in this set. Hello Darkness is another mono black one that I think will be fun. Good Knights is an Orzov Knights deck. And last but not least, I put in a Demir deck here that I might try playing. I really, you know, I'm super against playing blue, but I put I put blue cards in here. I put a Demir deck in here for me to try and play. I was looking through the cards that are in here and I thought, oh, this deck looks evil and I think that sounds fun. And so I might be a bad person now because I wanted to play blue cards. Oh no, what's happening to me? So let's get, okay, let's get, let me, hold on. Let me turn my um, game audio down first of all. Okay, let's get right into it. I'm going to play, I want to start with one of my, um, the knights look fun, yes. Uh, feel the same as blue, the more, the more you play with it, the more, yeah. I mean, some blue cards are okay. There's, there's like a healthy balance. I'm, I can't, I certainly can't go mono blue. No, 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 no. Um, but some blue I'm kind of becoming okay with and I feel bad about it like I feel really guilty I'm gonna start with the good night stick let's play it I'm um I'm so excited to be invited to this event I've been invited to like the last three early access events and it's really awesome because wizards gives you this account that literally has every card and standard in it so I can build any deck I want. It's way better than like my personal account, which is super scrubby. Um, okay, so this is um, not great because I only have two lands, so I'm really scared. Oh, uh-oh, my computer froze. Hold on, bear with me one second. My... My computer froze. Uh oh. Okay. It's coming back. Well. Uh, my arena my arena died, unfortunately. And and my stream got all messed up. Oh boy. Oh, thank you. 
El Magnifico for the host. Thank you so much. Unfortunately, I'm not playing any arena at the moment, so let me try this again. I had, I've had some technical difficulties with the early access events because it's a different game client and I think, I think they have bugs with it and stuff. Um, I don't know what happened to, I don't know what happened to my stream. It looks crazy. Um, I'm so sorry. Wait, does it still look fine? To you all? I think it does. Um, okay, hold on. Um, I'm going to actually concede this game that I'm in the middle of. It's not showing up. Okay, hold on. Bear with me. I'm so sorry. Um, I'm going to log out and log back in. Because for some reason, it's not showing up on my stream. Okay, hold on. Um, yeah, this is like super embarrassing, but if you've ever, if you've ever watched one of my streams before, you know, this, this can happen. My, my arena can get real scrubby. That is for sure. Okay, here we go. I... I had like two, I had like two arenas running and one of them was like in the background. So I killed that. And I'm hoping we can get it back up here. <gasps> okay, can you see it? Can you see it? Can you see my arena? I think it's there now. I think it's there. Yay, I think it's there. Okay, gosh. Woo! All right, great start to the stream. Great start to the stream. Ah. No, not really. It's gonna get better. It's only gonna go uphill from here. Okay, so let's try to play um, a match again with our good Knights deck. Okay, here we go. Let's not crash this time, Arena. We don't like that. That makes for not very fun gameplay. Okay. All right, here we go. We're getting into a game. It's gonna be fine. Um, I don't know exactly what's in this deck, so... Thank you, Lost God Ty Ty J for following me. Ty J, I'm so sorry. I'm obviously I can't read. Um, I don't feel like I can keep this. So I'm gonna mulligan. Um, okay, this one is fine. I will keep this. I guess I'll get rid of my Cavalier of Night. Because it's super expensive. Um, okay, I'm keeping this. We'll get rid of this. Here we go. We've got some stuff to do here. Um, I will enter this one tapped because I don't have anything I can play for one mana. Yeah, they, Taj. Okay, I'm so sorry. I was closer than most. Wow, that's really surprising. These are spoopy knights, aren't they? Okay. Um, Temple of Silence enters the Butterfield Tap. Uh, I just want to put my Corpse Knight out, so we're going to go for it. Go out there, Corpse Knight. Oh, I should say hi to my opponent. Hello, opponent. Oh, no, they're going to glass casket my Corpse Knight. Honestly, that was 
It's just like unnecessary. Um, should I, I guess I'll go ahead and get this out. I'll go ahead and get my Midnight Reaper out. Oh, and this one too. The Sword Target. Okay, I have to remember how this um, adventure thing works. So I, I would cast the adventure part first. And then I can cast the creature. I, I believe that's right. You may cast this card as an adventure. After you do exile it, you may then cast the creature later from exile. Got it. Reading the card explains the card, right? Right? Everybody knows that. Oh my! My opponent's playing Teferi! How is this happening to me right now? Oh! Uh, oh my goodness. Okay, this is gonna enter tapped. <laughs> you rarely expect people to pronounce it correctly. Oh, it's, it's in a language that isn't real. Okay. Um... Okay, we're scrying. Should we keep Oath of Kaya? When Oath of Kaya enters the battlefield, it deals three damage to any target and you gain three life. Yeah, we should. We should keep that for sure. Um, now I'm going to... <gasps> hey! I can destroy their Teferi right now with, with um, the Murderous Rider's adventure. So I'm going to do it. Goodbye, Teferi. See ya. Now I can cast the creature later. Ooh, fun. Yes, you can cast the creature right away if you would like, but then you can't cast the adventure part after that at all. You don't have to cast the adventure first if you don't want to. Right, 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 right. Gotcha. Yes. I was just thinking about if I want to cast both of them, which part do I need to cast first? And it is the adventure part. Uh, okay, so let's see. I'm going to, when Oath of Kaya enters the battlefield, it does three damage to any target and you gain three life. Okay, I'm going to do three damage to my opponent with Oath of Kaya. Uh oh, I guess they could counter me. They are playing, oh, they're playing Esper. Okay, so I'm going to target the player. Boom. Oh, and then I can play my Knight of the Ebon Legion. Yay! Okay, what else does Oath of Kaya do? Because I've honestly never played a deck with this in it. Whenever an opponent attacks a Planeswalker you control with one or more creatures, Oath of Kaya deals two damage to that player and you gain two life. Ooh! I don't think I have that many Planeswalkers in this deck, though. I know there's Soren, but I don't think there's any others than that. Um, yeah, Throne of Eldraine looks so fun. Like, all of the cards that have been previewed look amazing. I mean, I guess it's obviously the whole set at this point. But yeah, these cards look really fun. I've been super excited about the whole set coming out. And this event, too. Okay, now, Prison Realm... My creatures are in glass caskets and in prison. This is just, this is getting so mean. Okay, so this creature has an adventure. Return to heart creature card from your graveyard to your hand. I don't have any in my graveyard. Um, What I'm going to do is, okay, I'm going to cast my Midnight Reaper. And I'm going to cast my Knight of the Ebon Legion. Just get me some creatures out there. Oh, it has Gideon too. I think that's right. Yes. Oh, you've been saving wild cards for weeks. That's really smart. And yes, that's that's so hard to do. It's it's difficult at the end of a, you know, when you know a new set is coming and the end of the last one. Just kind of waiting for it. But that's really smart. Saving your wild cards. Because there are so many fun cards in this set. Oh, a witching well. What does this do? Emery Lurker of the Lock. Choose target artifact card in your graveyard. You may cast that card this turn. Oh. Yo! I've been 
Kaya's Wrathed. And, and honestly, I don't like it at all. Okay, well, I got another land. That's good. Spent a few weeks building a good deck for Standard 2020. Yeah, I could... I never really found a great deck for that event, personally. Um... Gains Death Touch and Lifelink. Okay. Uh oh, oh, oh! I can bring something back. Should I do that? I'm gonna do it. Um, I'm going to bring this back. I'm gonna bring my oh. <gasps> Which one should I bring back? I'm gonna bring back my Midnight Reaper because I have a Knight of the Oven Legion in my hand. Uh, okay, so I'll play that. Okay. What is my favorite format? Um, I really like to play limited. Um, I love drafting. That is my favorite thing to do in Magic. Now, I will say, I love drafting paper much more than I like drafting on Arena. It's just not the same. It, it never works out the same, and I don't... I don't ever get, I'm not able to build quite as good a deck on Arena for some reason. But I really love, I really love drafting. That, I would say, is my favorite format. I don't, I don't have tons of experience with other formats. I've played a little bit of Commander. It was, okay. Thank you, S. Pionson for the follow. I appreciate it. Um, yeah, I've played a little bit of Commander. I've played mostly Standard. I've never played like Modern or Legacy or any of those formats. Uh, okay, I'm going to get to Scry 1. Um, I guess I'll keep this. Knight? Sure. I'll keep it. Um, okay. What I'm gonna do, what is this? This is a flash creature. I guess I'll play this. I'm gonna play this. And... Then I have three mana left. And then I'm gonna play this. Yeah, I wanna get some creatures out there. I haven't been able to attack at all. I, yeah, paper drafting is the best. With paper drafting, you can read the packs, figure out what others are drafting. Yes. You're right. It's, when you do it on Arena, it's like, you just can't tell what's going on. It's, it's extremely random. For sure. I mean, I do it. I do, I do draft on Arena. But I prefer to draft paper cards. My opponent must have some sort of instant in their hand. They are just having to resolve. I, I hope they don't have another Kaya's Wrath because that would super suck. Like, big time. I mean, they they could. What is it? What is that? Banish into Fable? Copy it if you control an artifact, then copy it if you control an enchantment. You may choose, return target not on permanent to this owner's hand. You create a 2-2 white knight creature token. So they're going to do that four times? Or they're going to do it twice? I'm so confused. They, they have, they obviously have the board wipes. Uh, okay, I'm okay. They can't block my flyer. So there's that. Okay. Another witching well? Oh, I see. They keep sacrificing it to draw cards. Um, Because I think they've played like three witching wells at this point. Oh my, that would be four. We all want to do our part to help the environment. Okay, well, never mind. There's none in their graveyard, so. Just remember to bring your 
I'm obviously s completely wrong. I, I could have sworn they played one. Uh oh. Uh oh, what are they doing? They're looking at my creatures. Oh, okay, they're passing. Um, okay. So, I'm really scared. I don't know what to do. Okay, I'm not going to play this flash creature. I'm going to save that. I'll play this one. I'm going to play the venerable knight. And, yeah, I just don't know. Um, should I play my Minute Reaper? I'm really scared that they're going to board wipe again. So I'm not going to do it. Um, I'm just going to attack with my flyer. Okay, one attacker. Boom, here we go. Should I play my Knight of the Ebon Legion? I really want to. Um, should I do it? I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I can't not do it. I, I like to play creatures and I want them all to attack. Are they going to kill it? Are they going to kill it right now? Oh no, they're sacrificing. To draw cards. They're looking for their other board wipe. Oh no. Oh, that's a good point. Midnight Reaper is okay for a board wipe because you can get a lot of card draw. But I take damage. Oh no, they're glass casketing again. My Knight of the Ebon Legion, honestly, super unnecessary. They're glass casketing again. Not my flyer. Shoot, I can't do anything about it. Oh no. Okay, you know what? It's fine. This deck is evil. Look at all of this. Look at all my cards over there. Look at all my sweet little knights. They're all in trouble. They're trapped. What is this? Wish Claw Talisman. Oh, wait, this is the thing that your opponent gets, right? Oh, wow, that's interesting. Oh, this is deliciously evil. It really is. I, I would like to make them pay, but I'm struggling. Um, okay, let's see. I have enough mana. Let's see, do I need... Two, three, four, five. This can enter tapped. Okay, I'm gonna play my Midnight Reaper. Um, whenever a non-token creature you control dies, Midnight Reaper deals one damage to you and you draw a card. Should I attack with both of my creatures? And I'll have, yeah, I should. I'm gonna do it. So my Venerable Knight, if they block it, will die, but I'll get Okay, well, they're double blocking my one good creature, so that seems pretty legitimate. Uh, should I, should I flash this in? But it will, when it enters a battlefield, it target knight gains death touch and lifelink until end of turn, so I could kill both of their knights. Um, I don't need help from the peanut gallery here. Okay. Yay! I killed their knights. And I'm drawing cards. <gasps> Soren, Vengeful Blood Lord. <laughs> Where are the vampires? I know. We need more vampires. Yeah, okay. I killed both of their creatures. That was good. That, I... That was the right thing to do. Um, if they have a board wipe though, like all my creatures are dead. Um, I'm, I assume they have more prison realms. 
And I assume they have more Kaya's Wrath. So this could go badly. What does this thing do? Let's see. Wish Gold Talisman enters the battlefield with three wish counters on it. Pay one, tap it, remove a wish counter from Wish Claw Talisman. Search your library for a card, put it into your hand. Oh no, 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 no. Shimmer Dragon? Shimmer Dragon? Uh oh. Oh, this is good! Okay, I have three knights. Okay, I think they're dead. I think if I play this knight's charge, that they're dead. Any thoughts on that? I th okay, so that would be three damage, and they can only block one creature. Yeah, I believe, I believe they'll be dead. I think, what, what just happened? What are they doing? Oh, they're trying to draw cards. They're trying to draw cards. I'm gonna play Soren too. I will have revenge for House Marco. Next, all attack. Three attackers. Yay! Yay! They can only block one of my creatures. Oh, I forgot to say good game! I got it in. I got it in. Yay! My good knights were good. Ooh, that was a fun deck. I liked that one. I might play that one again. Oh, wow, I won a pack. Okay, too bad this isn't my real account. Okay, let's try good knights again because that was really fun. Um, yeah, with Soren, that, that that would have worked out really well, too, because I could, I think when I plus him, I could have done a little bit of damage to my opponent as well. If I had needed to. If they had some sort of trick up their sleeve. Okay, um, let's see. What is this? Oh, gosh. Okay, I'm fine. I'm keeping this. I don't know what the circle of loyalty is. Um, um enters tapped unless you control... Three or more other swamps. Well, I don't. So I'm just gonna go ahead and, and enter it tapped. Cause I don't even have any swamps in my hand. Okay, let me see. Um, I need to read this card. Creatures you control get plus one, plus one. Whenever you cast a legendary spell, I create a two, two white knight creature token with vigilance. Ooh, I can pay four, tap it, create a white knight. Ooh, okay, that's nice. Ooh, this is good. Equal number of knights you control. Ooh, okay. So, I'm gonna play my Knight of the Oven Legion. Oh, and I'm gonna say hi to my opponent. Hello, human token, 187. Ooh, they've got Liliana sleeves on their deck. I should put some on my deck. Yo, PKP is live and no one told me. Well, maybe you should have your notifications turned on there, Dougie Fresh. <laughs> it's okay, I haven't really been live very long and I, I had a bunch of technical difficulties at the beginning, so you, you missed the bad part, so it's fine. Um, okay, I'm gonna attack with this one. And, and should I attack with this one too? Godric Marwick, thank you for the follow. Oh my goodness. Um, I'm not gonna attack with that one, just that one. Cause they'll just block that one. I assume they're not going to use their incubation druid to block something that can kill it, unless they're like desperate. And they can't be desperate yet. We just started. Ooh, what are they playing? Oh my. Okay, here's a swamp and here's a temple. Um, I'm gonna play this so I can scry. Uh, I'll, I'll keep that, that's good. Now, should I play my Midnight Reaper or should I play my Circle of Loyalty? Wait, can I play this? 
Oh yeah, I can because it costs one less for each knight you control. I should play this and I'm going to play it. Boom. Okay, so now I'm going to attack with Gains indestructible. Ooh. I'm gonna attack with all. And I'm gonna make this indestructible. Ooh, this is so fun. <gasps> George from Greece, I'm so glad you're here. I need to talk to you because I sent you a card from my last early access event that you won in a giveaway and I just got it back in the mail. And like literally this week and it didn't go through. I'm really sorry. I'm gonna try to send it out again, um, but I need to go to the post That's office and find easy. out how much the postage That's should be like because it obviously wasn't right. I'm so sorry. It's been like six weeks and I'm, I'm really sorry. I didn't know, I just got it back. So I'm gonna I'm gonna try to send it out again, but I need to go to the post office and find out how much it's, the postage is because I, I messed I it up. Oh, Doug, you plugged me on Discord. Let's get a chat party going. Yes, let's. Thank you so much. Um, okay. While I was talking, I obviously missed Teferi and Vraska. So what what just happened? Uh, I'm not. You know what? How much does this cost? Okay, wait a second. I'm gonna do the smart thing and cast this first. I don't know what I missed, but pfft. okay. If I cast my Midnight Reaper, can I can I still cast um, the Circle of Loyalty? No, I can't. I'm gonna cast the Circle of Loyalty. Um, okay, and what I'm going to do is attack with all of these. Oh no, oh no. Should I attack their planeswalkers? I really hate it when people play planeswalkers. I mean, you know what I mean? Because like, I have to waste my attack on these dumb planeswalkers. Look at that. They just let it go through because they don't really care about their planeswalkers. I could have done all that damage to their face. I mean, oh no, what's happening? Who's more foolish? The fool. The fool who who? Oh, they're playing Oko. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. Yeah, they're gonna attack me with that silly, that silly goose. Oh no, it's Garuk. Or I'm sorry, maybe it's Garrick. I'll, I've i just always pronounced it Garouk, but last time I said that, everybody made fun of me, so I guess I was wrong. Uh, face is the place. I know I prefer to attack people to their face, but what is this deck? What is this deck? This is a four-color deck. It's not poisoned. Trust me. I'm just kidding. It's a, it is a four-color deck. Yes. Oh, God. Okay, Soren. This is good, right? Oh, hey, hey, I just got a knight. Okay, okay. Um, Creatures and planeswalkers you control have lifelink. Deals one damage to target player or planeswalker. Ooh, should I do that? Um, but who should I do it to? It doesn't matter. I'll just do it to them. I guess I'll just do it to their face. Return to our creature with converted mana cost X from your graveyard to the battlefield. Oh, wait a second. Wait a second. I might do that. Honestly, I might do that. I'm gonna do that. That costs two. I'm gonna, yes, I'm gonna bring back. Okay, okay. I'm doing things. I'm doing things. <laughs> Sword is always good, of course. Hi, MTG strategist. Where's the cat? Free the cat. I know she's hiding. She didn't like the outfit. Um. Okay, so I'm gonna attack with all. Ugh! I'm just gonna attack their face. I'm just gonna attack their face. I mean, why do they have so many planeswalkers? Oh my goodness! Okay, they're blocking, but. I can put counters on. 
Um, I'm gonna put a counter on this. And I'll just put both of my counters on my Knight of the Ebon Legion. Oh, uh-oh. Oh no, did you see what happened just now? When this creature dies, put a loyalty counter on each Garruk you control. I'm sorry, Garrick you control? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, he's at seven. At minus six, you get an emblem with creatures you control. I have plus three, plus three, and trample. Oh. Uh-oh. 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 I might, I might have made a mistake. I might have made a mistake attacking them to their face this time. I probably should have attacked both of their planeswalkers. I'm... I definitely made a mistake. I'm gonna say, oops. Uh, okay, so I'm not gonna block because what's the point? Oh, a reckoning will come, Soren. Uh, <laughs> that was rough. That was really rough. What, what am I supposed to do now? Look at all these crazy creatures they have. I feel like I'm in trouble. I mean, I have a lot more health than they do, but let's be real. I'm in trouble. I'm in big trouble. I, I can't attack. <laughs> I've made a huge mistake. Joe Bluth. Oh my goodness, yes. It's true. It's true. I'm Joe right now. Err, uh, no. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Hi, Card Sphere. Yeah, it's happening with the oh, no's. Oh, it's happening. I invite you to change your ways. Why did they just make my Midnight Reaper an elk? I... I'm so... Um... Confused. And upset. Look at this! Look at these two, two, five wolves! They're literally gonna rip my throat out! This is horrible! Oh my goodness, human token 187. This deck is out of control. Hydroid Crassus? It's a 15 15! Destroy target creature or planeswalker. Okay, I guess I'll destroy their Hydroid Crassus. I'm gonna lose two life for it, but I feel like maybe it's worth it. I don't know. Should I sacrifice this freaking food token? I mean, yeah, I'm, look at this, sacrifice food. I'm doing it. I'm gaining life. Um, okay, well, there's literally no point in attacking. Wait a second. Okay, wait, no, they have Wintermore Commander up and two wolves. I'm not gonna attack. This is going so badly. This is, this is going. Why do they have so many cards in their hand? How did this happen? Okay, I used to think my deck was good, but I had only played it one time and well, I didn't know any better. But now I know better. My deck is just passably Please mediocre. Put on your true shape. Oh wow. Another Oko? What how are you doing this? Those blind to tyranny. They're destroyed their first Oko. Why did they do that? I guess so they can plus him again. I get it now. Change your ways. Okay. What how can we come back from this? We can't. We, 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 we can't. We're just gonna good game and no blocks. We cannot come back from this. Oh my goodness! That was rough. That was rough, everyone. Yeah, I, I, okay. You know what? I'm gonna play a different deck, okay? Not that my deck is bad. It's just that that deck was like super OP. Hi, Mr. Vainless. Thanks for the follow. Yeah, the elk was OP, right? 
Oh no, my game's bugging out. Okay, never mind, it's fine. I mean, it was bugging out. Did you all see that? That was weird. Um, okay, let's play our mono black deck because I'm super excited for mono black. Okay, let's try it. We're, we're going to see how mono black does and it's going to be great. Oh, <gasps> my opponent looks so scary. Okay, mono black, here we go. Ooh, Forbidden Fruit. <gasps> Sir Conrad! I should probably not keep this hand, but I'm going to. So, there's that. <laughs> Ooh, look at my opponent. They've got the special avatar and special sleeves. I'm a super scrub. Wait, they have the fox pet! Look! How did they get it? I looked earlier to figure out how I could get the fox pet. And I couldn't figure it out. Okay, after this game, remind me. After this game, we're going to do a giveaway. And we're going to get the fox pet put on our thing. So, don't let me forget to do those things. We're going to do those things after this game. So, mm -hmm. I have... Um, Sorry, my mom's texting me. It's her birthday today. So, yeah. Okay. Um, ooh, look. Look at this. Unless you control a swamp. I do control a swamp, so boo yeah. Return dark creature card from your graveyard to your hand. I can't do that, so I'm just going to go ahead and cast this as a creature. I don't want to wait. Okay, I'm going to attack. Um... Okay, yes, happy birthday to my mother. Um, what was I saying? Oh, the codes that I have to give away are for Throne of Eldraine Mastery. Let me just, hold on a second. I don't have the information in front of me. They're, they are for, the codes are for Arena and they're for Throne of Eldraine, like, it's like 1,000 XP or something. So, yeah, it's for a 1,000 Eldraine set mastery XP. So, <clears throat> if you know that you're going to um, <coughs> get the mastery pass for Throne of Eldraine and you win the giveaway, you can get that. But if you, if you don't and you would rather win um, the rare in one of these packs, then you can do that too. So I have options. Uh, why is this lit up so special? Um, oh gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, 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 okay. I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do this. Target player draws two cards and loses two life. I'm gonna do it to myself. <laughs> Happy birthday, mama kitten. Uh, okay, I'm going to attack with my flyer. Yeah, so when I do my giveaway, whoever wins the giveaway, you can choose to win the uh, arena code for the Throne of Eldraine Mastery XP, or you can choose to win the rare card in a pack that I open. And I will pick a random pack to open. And I will send you the rare. Uh, okay. Yes, because of, because of Adamant, I saw that. Because I was able to Pay the adamant cost. It was lit up special and it was confusing. Um, I don't think I have any creatures in my graveyard yet. No, I do not. Okay, I'm gonna play a swamp. Destroy target creature. Ah, oh, I should destroy this thing because it's really giving me trouble. So I'm going to do it. And I'm going to create a food token. Uh oh, they don't like this, do they? Oh no! Oh no! Which creature are they gonna kill? No, why did they do that? What? That was so mean! Preddy? Why did you kill that thing? I really like their deck though, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, Doug, thank you for so much for hanging out. I really appreciate it. What? Hold up. They just took one of my cards. 
Okay, I'm getting... You draw a card and you lose a life. No. Don't want to do that. Return dark creature card from the graveyard to your hand. <gasps> I could do that and get my own my own creature back. Or I could... Uh, or I could play Bell of the Ball. Um, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna play Bell of the Bell of the Brawl, and then I'm also going to pay. I'm going to play this creature. Okay. Okay. So now I have some blockers at least for their like crazy shenanigans. Robber of the Rich totally stole my card. Whenever Robber of the Rich attacks, if defending player has more cards in hand than you, exile the top card of their library. During any turn you attack with a rogue, you may cast that card and you may spend mana. Ooh. Yikes. Um, so I'm going to kill this with Death Touch. And I'm going to let the other one through. That's what I'm going to do. Hello, Pack Crack Fever. Take Order of Midnight with Order of Midnight. Yes, I thought about that. I'll, I'm, I'm, I might do that next turn. Um, so my kitty cat is not here because she gets very upset when I put that costume on her. So I only put it on her for the picture. Um, if you didn't see my super cute picture with my kitty cat, it's on my Twitter. My Twitter is pkp underscore magic. You can go check it out. We're totally in costume today. She hates the costume though, but she's just so cute. No, why is this person evil? Discard two cards. Okay, I'll discard that. How dare they make me discard Sir Conrad the Grim? I wanna play this card so bad, but I don't have enough mana to pay for it. I literally just drew the mana for it. I literally just drew the mana for it. I'm so mad right now. I'm so, wait, I could return it to my hand. Wait, should I do that or should I get the other Order of Midnight back? When another creature dies, or creature spend the graveyard anywhere on the battlefield. Yeah, I'll do that and get my Star Conrad back. Uh, okay. Yeah, okay, I'm getting my Sir Conrad back. Okay, what's happening with the food tokens? You gain three life? Okay, I don't need to do that right now. Okay, I'll play this. And I will attack with my creature. Oh, it gives a counter to my other creature. Whenever it attacks, other knights you control get plus one, plus zero. Oh, nice. <coughs> I'm sorry. <coughs> uh, okay. <gasps> okay, we got a swamp. This is good. Sir Conrad. Here comes Sir Conrad. Um, okay. They could double block. They could double block this and kill it. What should I do? Okay, it's okay. I'm going to do it. Because if they kill it, Oh, it buffed him. Oh, he's a human knight too. I did not realize that. How much damage am I doing? Um, I guess I'll kill the Knight of the Ebon Legion because they can pump that one up. And I want it to go away. <gasps> Yay. Oh, but I'm down to six. This is bad. I really love Sir Conrad's ability. Oh, do you think they have a trick? I mean, they must have a trick, right? Um, I guess I'll block this, whatever. If they kill my Sir Conrad, it's okay because, uh, I'll still, yeah, I thought I'll still get the thing, but they, but they got lifelink, dang. Oh my goodness. Can you turn the air down a little bit? It's like really hot. Okay, I drew a swamp, so that sucks, but 
guess what? I'm gonna get some life back because I'm baking a pie. So yeah, how about that? I'm up to 10. Um, should I attack? Oh, this creature can't block. So yeah, I should definitely attack. That would have been so dumb. Okay, here we go. Oh, not another Dreadhorde Butcher. Wow, these people, these people are like intense. Destroy a target. Ooh, and then lose two life. Ooh. Oh no. Okay, I'm not, I'm going to, let's see. I'm going to lifelink this. I think they might kill me no matter what. Mm, let's see. Let's see. Okay, I'm going to lifelink. Wait, what can I do here? Draw a card, then you lose life equal to the number of cards in your hand? Ooh. Okay. I can't do that because they'll they'll hit me with at least four damage. So I just I'm gonna attack with my thing. I've only got one blocker. Okay, I'm so scared. Okay, I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I might die right now. Um, does this have a thing? Ugh. This thing has lifelink. That sucks. Just remember to bring your reusable bags. Yep, it's that easy. In fact, with just one small act, customers help Publix um, okay. five million paper and plastic bags every month. So let's keep it going. Let's all remember to bring our reusable I guess I'll block this one. Are they gonna kill it? Do you think they have another shock? me and kill me. Oh, Legion's end! Oh, man. Okay. Should I do this thing? I'm only going to lose one life, so I'm going to do it and hope it... Ugh! This is not helpful. Uh, okay. Well, I don't want to do that. Yeah, this is over. This is definitely over. Okay, good game. They got a they got a little wrinkle out. Okay. Well, we didn't win that one, but I did like that deck. I really did like that deck. That was a fun deck. We will try it again. But First, we're going to do a giveaway. So, the way I do my giveaways is I have everyone who wants to enter the giveaway type a number in chat between 1 and 20, and then I will roll a 20 sided die, and whoever gets the closest wins the giveaway. So, if you want to be in the giveaway, You've seen a five color deck that looks really cool. Efren, I do not want to play a five color deck. I mean, come on. Okay, so I'm going to say giveaway open. Okay, and that's okay if you typed in before I said giveaway open. Okay, so for the, for the next minute or so, I will open my giveaway. Uh, remember to type in a number between one and 20. I will roll the die, and then you will choose, I'll pick a random pack to open and you can win the rare card in the pack, not the foil, but the rare card. Or you can win um, a code for Eldrain XP if you know you're gonna do the mastery, if you know you're gonna do the mastery thing, then that would be a good one. You'll get a thousand XP. Um, this, this thing is not rigged, Card Sphere. It is not rigged, but my streams are sponsored by Cardsphere. It's where I um, sell and buy all of my paper cards that aren't sealed product, although you can buy sealed product on there. 
So if you've never checked out Cardsphere, you should. It's a really great place to um, get rid of some of your bulk and stuff like that. Okay, so I have got to figure out how to get the fox. How do I get the fox on my... How do I get the fox on here? Like I want to, I want to show the fox. Profile? Pet select. <gasps> I see the words pet. There it is. There it is. What is this? No, oh, no pet. Fox. <gasps> A fey fox. Oh, <gasps> oh, so cute. Which one should I pick? You know, I kind of like the rare the least. I'm going to be honest. I like the common fox and the uncommon fox too. I think I'm going to pick the uncommon fox because it just kind of looks like the little, the fox is wearing like this little leaf armor. Oh my gosh. I chose dog over cat. Well, it's a fox and it's a special event. So I'm just going along for the event. Okay. So no, this is not US only. You can, you can enter, you can enter my giveaway if you're not in the US. George did, he's in Greece. Now, I did send him a card and it never got to him. I in fact got it back. So I feel really bad about that, George, but I'm gonna try to send it back out again. Okay, so giveaway is now closed. Giveaway is closed. Okay, we're gonna roll the dice. Um, okay, here we go. We're rolling the dice. I rolled an 18. Okay, so let's see who got closest to 18. Um, okay, that, oh, okay, it's going to be President's Choice Coffee with 16. Yeah, that's it, President's Choice Coffee. You won the giveaway. So let me know if you would like the code for Arena or if you would like the rare from a random pack that I will open. Um, it could be War of the Spark, Corset 2020, or Ravnica Allegiance. So, let me know, President's Choice Coffee. What would you like? I'm gonna try and write this down if my pen will work. President's Choice Coffee, congratulations. Um, what would you like to win? If you want the, if you want the rare card, I will open the pack right now. You want an arena code. Okay. Um, so if you will reach out to me on Twitter and, um, send me a tweet, I will then message you and send you the code on Twitter. So, um, my Twitter handle is PKP underscore magic. If you don't have Twitter, you could also do Instagram. My Instagram can be found at Pixie Kitten Plays. Um, or you could even just email me. My email is pkp.magic at gmail.com. So, contact me one of those ways and I will send you over the code. Now, another thing. The code is not good until the 26th. That's when Throne of Eldraine will be available on Arena. So if you type it in before the 26th, which is Thursday, it won't work. So contact me one of those ways. Let me know your President's Choice Coffee on Twitch and I will send you over a code. So, okay, let's play some more. Um, I'm really, I'm waiting for the booster draft to be available. I think the booster draft event is gonna be available at 3 p.m. Pacific time. So that's the event that I wanna play later. But right now, I'm, I'm, you know what? I'm gonna play, let's, okay, everybody. Let's play the Demir deck. It's called, I named it I'm a Terrible Person because I really hate Demir. Um, so I'm going to feel bad playing this, but this deck looked interesting to me, so I'm going to try it. We're going to see how it goes. <gasps> My opponent's name is Con 
Confi coffee. What? Oh my goodness, look, look at my hand. Thief of Sanity, Drown in the Lock, Swamp, Mystic Sanctuary, Island, Kazmina, Murderous Rider. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, I feel really bad. I feel bad already. Uh, what does this do? Entrance Battlefield tabbed unless you control three or more other islands. Uh, okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and play this. And I'm gonna say hello to my opponent. <gasps> Look at my fox, everybody! Look how cute it is! Efren, I know, right? I know, but I try to branch out on these early access events and play different decks that so I'm not just like playing my same usual thing. <laughs> you become the very thing you swore to destroy. It's true. It's so true. Okay, what does this do? Counter target spell, convert a mana cost, what? Destroy, okay, hold on, this is confusing. Destroy target creature with converted mana cost less than or equal to number of cards in its controller's graveyard. Ah, just cast a card, just cast a card and move on. What's the name of your fox? Okay, my fox's name is, let me think for a moment. Um, my fox's name is Karen. Yep, that's right, Karen. My cat's name is Carl, and my fox's name is Karen. So, I think it's legit. Thief of Sanity. We're doing it. We're doing it. I don't know how to play this deck. Um, but... We're gonna figure it out. Gray, name it Gray. Why? <gasps> what just happened? Oh, questing beast. The fox wants to speak to the manager because of those Karen memes. Yes, this fox. Look, Karen, Karen wants to speak to the manager, everyone. Okay, I'm gonna play Kazmina because it's the only thing I can play, apparently. Uh, okay. Listen up, and I'll teach you a trick or two. I think I should, I think I should minus her and get rid of Drowning the Lock because I don't even have any cards in my graveyard. I'm gonna do it. My students are loyal. Ooh, Cavalier Gales! I'm gonna keep that. I'm gonna get rid of that. Thief of Sanity, let's see. They can block Thief of Sanity. Um, but then I'll get rid of their goose. So I'm gonna play it because they'll either not block and I'll get one of their cards or they will block and I'll get their goose dead. Ooh, okay. You may look at, you may look at the, and cast that card for as long as it remains exiled. You may spend mana. Oh, what should I do? Gruel Spellbreaker, Gilded Goose, or Nullhide Ferox. I guess I'll take their Nullhide Ferox. I don't know. You might even say their goose will be cooked. Yeah, that's a good one. That sounds kind of like a dad joke, but sure, sure. Yeah, look at the fox. The fox wants to be petted. It's so cute. Uh-oh, what's happening right now? What does this do? Each other non-human creature you control enters the battlefield with an additional 1-1 one, one counter on it? Grum Gully the Generous? Wait, why can't I block this thing? My schemes are ruined. Why did, her schemes are ruined now. Why did they kill her? Okay, questing beast can't be blocked by creatures with power two or less. Oh my goodness, Godric Marwick, you're so right. I'm so glad I picked it, even though I didn't know what I was doing. <gasps> Another Thief of Sanity. Actually, let's just double up on our thieves. Or what about Cavalier of Gales? And there's a battle of draw three cards and put two cards from your hand on top of your library in any order. When it dies, okay, should I do that? Should I do another Thief of Sanity? Should I do a Kazmina? What should I do? I'm gonna play the Cavalier of Gales. 
Oh my. Okay. Oh my. Okay. I, okay. I have to put two cards into your library. Enter the God Pharaohs? Ooh, that's good. Um, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Okay, this. I don't really want that card. And this. This is your kind of place. Because that's the next card I'll draw. Okay, this. Okay, that wizard does nothing, so I'll attack with the Thief of Sanity. I'm going to take more of their cards. Yes, the Feroxa block is. That's okay. That's what I'll do. Um. Ooh, another questing beast. I'll take that. Thank you very much. I'll take that. Thank you very much. Um. Except, honestly, the Ferox, you can't cast non-creature spells. That's pretty bad. Okay, what's going to happen now? What is this over here? Escape to the wild? Do you mean play an additional land? <gasps> How did they kill it? Draw four cards? If an, op if an opponent has se seven or more cards? Can I look? How many cards? They have six cards in our graveyard. Hold on. Okay, I don't want this. And I also don't want this, I don't think. I have an island in my hand. I'm so scared. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I'm so scared. You like the new animation for Thief of Sanity? It's cool, right? I noticed that too. I didn't know that was new because I don't think I've ever played Thief of Sanity before. Because I'm not evil. Well, today, I guess I'm evil today. Yeah, I guess. I guess I'm, I am. Um, I guess I'll just chump block something with my wizard, right? I'll just... Oh, my arena just, just shut down! Okay, okay, okay. Hold on. We're going to get back in really fast. It just, like, straight up closed out. Oh, my goodness. Okay. We're coming back. I hope I don't. I hope my opponent's not waiting. I'm so sorry, Comfy Coffee. I'm really sorry if you ever see this Comfy Coffee. Um, yeah, I'm sorry. I'm gonna block something. I'm so sorry. I I'm not trying to like rope you. <gasps> Was it Karen's fault? Karen. What should I do? I I feel like I should play one of these. Okay, I'm going to play this questing beast. That's right. That's right. And I'm going to attack with Thief of Sanity again. Will they sacrifice their goose? They won't. I'm down to four health. Like, I'm pretty much dead here. I don't, I, I don't know if I can come back from this, honestly. Oh, wait, I can cast this thing. Sure, let's throw it out there. Let's put a 1-1 one, one counter on it because we've already done combat, so haste would be done. Uh, that's the Nullhide's other ability? If you think I'm a crazy beast, where do you see my mates? Oh, I see. Oh no, what's happening? Domri? Okay. We might be dead. We might be dead. Uh, yeah, we're definitely dead. So I'm just going to say good game. Okay. Well, you know what? I have learned my lesson. I won't play that deck anymore. It's not good. And it's kind of a jerk deck because it's Demir. So naturally, it's a jerk deck. So let's, let's play a different, let's play a different deck. So chat, why don't you tell me which deck you would like to see me try out? Um, hello, Arena, hello. Um, hello, Arena, my arena is just a black screen here. 
Uh, yes, thank you. My cosplaying, yes, this all this is all for the event. Very much so. Um, yeah, it's I'm supposed to be Robin Hood, so that's what this is. Uh, okay, so here are here are the decks that I have. So if anyone has um, a suggestion for one of these decks, ooh, the red, the mono red one might be fun. Red, black, and white deck next, the Mardu. Oh, Mardu Knights, yeah, that one's probably very fun too. Okay, we'll do it, you know what? I'm not waiting for anybody else's suggestion. We're just doing it. We're going for it. I'm a terrible person was a really bad deck, so we're not gonna play that one ever again. Mardu Knights, this one, this one will be fun. I hope. I, I, it will. I really like the Knights, the knight stuff, it's, it's a lot of fun. Knights are like the new um, tribe right now. They're just like the super hot tribe. And since vampires are like pretty much going out with the rotation, I mean, yeah, there are still vampires, but a lot of the good vampires are rotating out. Knights can be the new thing. That's fine. Um, okay, I think this is a good hand actually-ish. It's fine. I'm gonna keep it. <laughs> that deck was for terrible people and I'm not terrible. Well, thank you. I'm not terrible. I'm not. Um, okay. Tournament grounds. I can cast my Knight of the Ebon Legion. Um, I'm gonna say hello to my opponent. Hello there, Switch Axe. My fox was barking at my opponent. Oh no, here we go with this Rakdos deck again. Um, they want to put counters. I'm not gonna block it because they want it to die and put a counter on this. Wait. Oh dang, I thought when it got blocked it put a counter on there, but I obviously read it wrong. Okay, um, we are going to, we're going to do this, and we're going to cast our Wintermore Commander. The, I really like this card, really like this card. Uh, first strike and haste. I'll go ahead and attack for this turn and see, I guess they probably won't block, so I'll get in one little damage. Oh my, the, they are, these, my opponent is super intense. First strike in haste. Um, do you think they have a trick? I really don't want them to kill my Wintermore commander. Don't do it, fingers crossed. They're doing it! Wait a second, I don't understand what just happened. Like I literally have no idea. Damage can't be prevented this turn. Stomp deal is too damaged to any target. So how did they kill my Wintermore commander though? Oh, because they killed my other creature first and I didn't have any knights. A Wintermore commander's toughness is equal to the number of knights you control. Ugh. Okay, that, that sucked. But it's okay, we're gonna come back from that. We're coming back from that. Wait. Oh. Well, that was, that was, I was going to try to cast my Fervent Champion too. But my mana tapped, it tapped both of my tournament grounds. That was, that was sucky. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Dreadhorde Butcher's getting really big. <laughs> okay. Um, Temple of Silence. We're going to scry. Okay, I think that's fine. We're gonna keep that creature. Let's see, Murderous Rider. Okay, we are gonna destroy one of their creatures. We're, I think we should definitely do this. Um, um we're gonna destroy their Dreadhorde Butcher is what we're gonna do. 
Can I not do it? I can't do it. I can't. Can I? It was lit up like I couldn't do it. No, I can't. Oh, dang. Um. Okay, okay, it's okay. We'll play our other nights. It did it again! I don't want it to use that because I want my red mana. Erg! It's it's like automatically tapping my tournament grounds. Ugh. Okay, I'm I'm getting I'm getting mad. Oh. Okay, this thing has menace. I'm just gonna double block this Dreadhorde Butcher because I want it to die. Okay. <gasps> Are they gonna do something? <sighs> oh my god! This is so annoying! Uh, you gain X life and each opponent loses X life where X is the number of knights you control. That's not helpful right now. But I can cast that for one. So I could do that last. Let's see. Destroy target creature. Okay, I can do this now. No, I can't. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. And you lose two life. I don't want to do that. Okay, so I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. Is this a knight? It's not. Dang. Okay, and then what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do this sorcery. X is the number of knights you control. I control two knights. Okay, I'm gonna do this. And if I attack with all, I'll just attack with, okay. I'll attack with these two. And I'll save up a blocker. Oh. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I got it. I think I got it. Hi, Magic with Zuby. Stop getting mad. I can't help it. <laughs> My, the auto tapper has been glitching like crazy. Yeah, and it's been it, it's been messing me up. It's been messing up my gameplay like big time. Oh no. Knight of the Ebon Legion. Ugh. Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just chomp block this thing. Oh my goodness! Yes, I'm going to kill the Dreadhorde Butcher. I'm going to kill it with this. I'm gonna lose to life, but I think that's okay. So that costs, th oh wait, 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 I have a land. Oh no, I'm, I have to pay two life or I can't do anything else. I have to pay two life. Okay, so I can cast, this would be good for the lifelink. Well, but this would be good whenever you cast a night spell, create a two one. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is kill their Dreadhorde Butcher. Let me make sure I'm okay with the, the mana that it's tapping. Yes, I am okay with that. I'm gonna kill the Dreadhorde Butcher and I'm gonna lose two life. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's right. Oh no! Oh no! Dougie Fresh, you called it. Oh no, I didn't know it was gonna kill me. Boo, boo. Okay, let's try this deck again because that was, that was not fair. I don't know why, I don't know why I keep facing off against these Rakdos decks. But I've played like multiple already. Okay, it's fine. This person has a Teferi avatar. I seriously doubt they're playing a Rakdos deck. 
Um, okay, so we have this, this. Oh, a Chandra is in this deck. Wow, who'd have thought? I'm gonna keep this, but it's not great. Um, Zuby, you are about to get on. Oh, my arena just shut down again. This is so frustrating. Oh my gosh, it just like, it's just off my screen, like instantly. Mm. Yeah, I mean, I, I always have problems with, with the um, early access event. It's super glitchy. Here we go. We're gonna try again. Now my opponent is like super mad at me. Um, this can enter tapped because I, I, I could have cast that, but I'm awful. Hi, Anski. Thank you for the follow. Oh, okay. Well, our opponent is not playing Rakdos there. Magic with Zuby. So there's that. Um, I am going to play this. I didn't mean to do that. I thought that I was going to be able to pay two life. But that's fine. I'll keep that. <laughs> Early access equals beta test. Pretty much. There are a lot of glitches here. Okay, I want to play a card that I can pay two life to make it enter not tapped. Here we go. I did it this time. I did it this time. Okay, I have a lot of good cards here. So, what I can do, if you control another night, look at top five cards of your library. Ooh, that's good. Okay, I'll wait to do that. The first thing I'm going to do, um, Inspiring Veteran or Wintermore Commander or what should I do, what should I do? Um, I'm going to play Inspiring Veteran. And then, uh-oh, uh-oh. Is this a counter spell? Is this a, oh, okay. Okay, and then I'm gonna play Venerable Knight. Okay, okay. Ooh, she's a three, two. Hey. Why? Honestly. Why, Dave C? Why? Sweep? That one was rough. Really rough. <laughs> I know, right? That was so mean. Oh, should I play Chandra? Whenever one or more loyalty characters are removed from Chandra, she deals that much damage to target opponent or planeswalker. What? That's weird. I don't want to do that. I'm scared. Um... But I guess I will. I don't know. I don't know how to play this deck. I knew you needed my help. Okay, we're gonna do this. What's that smell? Exile the top card of our library, which we couldn't play. Now it's exiled. Oh, fervent champion, we wanted you. Crackling Drake. Oh, oh my. Mm mm. Uh uh. Not going well. Not going well. You will be a pile of ashes. <gasps> Target an opponent or planeswalker. Oh, look at that. I've never played this Chandra before. Okay, Sacred Foundry is coming out, and I'm going to pay two life so that I can play both my winter commander. Wait, how does this work? If you control another knight, look at the top five cards. Okay. I'm gonna play Winter Commander first. And then I'm gonna play, put it in your hand, this one. Yes. Oh, I want this. Yes, I want this. I'll play that next turn. Okay, and then, I guess I'll just plus her again. Even though I'm like losing cards that way. Is that bad? Eee, is it? Is it bad though? I need more blue in my deck. No, 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 no. 
an opt. Look at all these cute little fairies. Honestly, they're actually like super. I legitimately hate this deck my opponent is playing. La, a legitimately. I'm so mad right now. I'm so mad right now. Waste of my time. She said this was a waste of her time. You know what? At least my fox is happy. At least Karen's happy. That's all that matters, right? Me. All of their creatures are flyers. Like, this sucks. Um, I'm going to cast this. And then I'm going to cast this. Oh, my goodness. Okay, what am I what am I trying to do right now? Put one of these in my hand. Oh, okay, I'll pick a murderous rider so I can destroy one of their creatures. Probably their crackling drake, right? Yes. Can I get through another turn without dying? Because this this is it deck. I mean. Oh no! Another crackling drake. This is bad. This is really bad. Dave C, why are you like evil, honestly, with this deck? Okay. What we're gonna do right now, this is fine. I'm gonna lose two life if I do this. It's okay because it's worth it. It's worth it. Guess what? Guess who's coming out? Inspiring veteran. Do any of these creatures have lifelink? Because I desperately need it. I'm just gonna attack with all. I mean, I have to. Like, they have all flyers. It's not like I can block them. Oh. Hello, Ben1976. How's it going? Thanks for hanging out. This is why we play Esper? No, 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 no. This is fine, the room's on fire. Yeah, that's exactly what's happening right now. Shoot. Okay. Okay, that was bad. Okay. Let's pick a different deck. So I've played multiple different decks and none of them have been like super hardcore. You know what? Let's play some mono red aggro because I'm, you know what? I'm doing okay, Ben1976. Oh, I have a better idea. Let's do a giveaway. Let's do another giveaway. I totally forgot about that. Okay, let's do another giveaway. If you want to enter the giveaway, type a number in chat between one and 20, and I will roll a 20-sided die and see who gets the closest, and you'll win the giveaway. So I'm going to type giveaway open in chat, and your... You can win either an arena code for 1000 Throne of Eldraine Mastery XP, or if you if you are gonna get the Mastery Pack then um, for Throne of Eldraine, then I'll open up a random booster pack and you will win the rare that is in the booster pack. Not the foil, but just the rare that's in the booster pack and I'll send it to you. So, if you want to enter my giveaway, go ahead. No, it's not Price is Right rules. You can go over. Um, no, 11 is not taken. You're fine. You're fine, Dougie Fresh. You're fine. So, if you want to enter the giveaway, type a number in chat right now between 1 and 20. 1 and 20. Oh, I just, I just dropped the die down my shirt. Oh my gosh, this is so embarrassing. I got it out though, it's fine. It's fine, I did not do that on purpose. I 100% did not do that on purpose. I say not the foil because what if it's like a mythic foil? That's not the one I'm sending out, I'm just sending out the rare. I mean, I feel like I need to disclose that, honestly. Like, why would you, why would you like? <laughs> I'm so, I'm so embarrassed right now. 
well. Okay. Okay. So, um, yeah. So, just another another few more minutes for my giveaway. Um, and last time we did we did the giveaway. Um, President's Choice Coffee won, and they wanted the arena code. So there's that. This stream has it all, including cheap thrills. You know what we're missing? We're missing some kitty cat because um, I have my I have my cat's costume right here. Like just in just in case she comes in the room, I'll put the costume on her, and we'll be like totally set for this Throne of Eldraine fairy tale. Thing, like totally so um, yeah okay okay everyone we're gonna close the giveaway right now I I can't okay giveaway closed okay and I'm gonna roll the die here we go here we go I rolled a 14 okay so who got closest to 14 magic with Zuby who says count me out Magic with Zuby, you don't want to win. You know what? Zuby is going to be streaming his own early access event, so I'm sure that's why he doesn't want to win. So, Zuby, you're not winning this. So, the next person closest to 14 is going to be... It's going to be Ben1976. Ben1976, you have won because Z Magic with Zuby forfeited his win. Okay, Ben1976, would you like to win a code for Magic Arena with 1,000 Throne of Eldraine Mastery XP? Or would you like to win a rare in one of these random booster packs? Let me know. Once I said no foils, he said count me out? <laughs> okay, you don't get to win the foil. I'm sorry. Okay, Ben, let me know what you would like to win. And if you want the rare in the booster pack, I'll open it right now and we'll all see what it is. So, um, let me know what the, let me know what you want to win. And we will see. What, what do you choose, Ben? You want the code, okay. So that is wonderful, okay. So, will you contact me on social media? You can, um, you can like at me on Twitter. My Twitter is PKP underscore magic. You can reach out to me on Instagram. It's Pixie Kitten Plays. Or you can send me an email, pkp.magic at gmail.com. And contact me on one of those platforms and let me know that you are Ben1976 on Twitch and I will send you over that arena code. Now the code is not good. The code will, won't unlock any foils, that's correct. That is 100% accurate. It is for XP for the mastery, the Throne of Eldraine mastery pass. Um, the code is not good until the 26th, which is Thursday because that's when Throne of Eldraine goes live on arena. So if you try to put it in before then, it won't work. Just so you know. So, um, Dougie Fresh, your name is Ben, but you go by Doug on Twitter. Okay, that's confusing, but whatever. Okay, here we go. Let's play some more. Yes, you can email me. No, everyone, do not email me and claim to be Ben1976. Don't do it. Don't do it. That's mean. Only the real Ben can email me. I mean, the rest of the rest of y'all can email me, but it would be really mean, honestly. Let's play another game. I'm gonna play the mono red deck. It has, I think, it has like the dwarfs. Um, you can, you Ben, you can use the code. Um, it will not be redeemable until the release of Throne of Eldrain on 926. You can use it on 926, so that's fine. Um, <laughs> y'all are the worst. Doug and Pet Crack Fever. You want me to play Sealed? I don't like Sealed. Okay, I'll do it. You know what? You know what? We're gonna do it. Let's do it. Why not? Here we go. We're playing Sealed. Yeah, we want to purchase this. 
Okay, we're opening packs. Please don't be blue. <gasps> oh, this is so good. Oh, I love this. <gasps> we can play black and green. Okay, I love this. This is good. This is good. This is good. Okay, whatever, whatever, gems, whatever, whatever. <laughs> hey, it's me, Zuby1976. What, why do people just stop, honestly? Honestly. Y'all are the worst. Okay, we're gonna try for black and green. You know why? Because we wanna play, um, I'm gonna pronounce this correctly. Ayara. We're gonna play Ayara first of Loxwain for sure. Ha! <laughs> Heck yes. Oh, look at all these witches' cottages. We wanna do that. Okay. Um, Doug, you love you love sealed and and what troll? What troll? Was it a green? Was it a green? Ooh, look at that. Okay. Um, oh yes, the Feasting Troll King. Whoa, two green, 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 green. Oh, wow, that's so good. I feel like I have to put it in there. I feel like I have to. Yes, it is green. Okay, thank you, Ben. I will get that code over to you probably after my stream. Since it's not, since you can't use it right away anyways. Okay, Pat Crack Fever, you're so done. You're done. Honestly, like, you're done. Um, okay, I'm not good at, I'm not good at building a sealed deck. So, any, any suggestions are great. I mean, okay, I need creatures. Which is Cottage? I got three. So, um... I don't know, like, okay, so maybe I'll put like one or two in. Maybe I'll put two in. Um, hey, Dean from Young Corpse TV. <laughs> I'm sorry, I mean Doug Zuby and host of Pat Crack Foils. How's it going? Um, so Efren, I said that you're done and also they both apply. They, they both apply, so there's that. Okay, I wanna put in Lash of Thorns because I like that death touch thing. Um, I wanna put in... Uh, okay, Gingerbread Cabin. Should I do that? Okay, I'll put in a couple of ginger... Maybe just one. Just maybe just one for luck. Uh, okay, so your email is pretty much your name, so that's fine. I'll figure it out. Oh, Dean, thank you so much for watching my stream while you're at work. I really appreciate it. I, I mean, that is pretty cool for sure. Um, okay, so I'm gonna play, I'm gonna put Baked into a Pie in my deck because that's some great removal. Um... Whenever a creature attacks you or a planeswalker you control, that creature's controller loses one life and you gain one life. I like that. Whenever a creature attacks you or a planeswalker you control, I really like that. I want to put that in my deck. Um, I'm going to also like, hmm. We need some creatures. Tempting Witch is pretty good with the food tokens. I guess I'll put two of her in. Um, the the Lockwave Paladin. That can be good. And the Adamant is really good. So, turn the volume down or the office will think you're watching murder videos? Am I that loud? I mean, I'm so sorry. Like... My bad. Okay, whatever. So, okay, um, okay, so I'm building this deck and I'm like, <gasps> Efren, you're not gonna open the collector's boosters? I, I really want some of those. 
Like, I really want some of the collector's boosters. But why are they so expensive? But I love the art on those. I really, really, really want some. I don't know what to do about it. I don't know what to do about it. Um, okay, fell, fell the pheasant. Fell the pheasant does five damage to target creature with flying, create a food token. Honestly, I'm probably gonna put that in my deck because the chances, are you watching Peter Pan murder videos? Oh, Irfrin, you are the worst. Oh my God. Oh my God. Honestly, the worst. I'm not, this This is not a Peter Pan outfit. This is a Robin Hood outfit. Okay. It's a Robin Hood outfit. It's a freaking Robin Hood outfit. Duh. Okay. Kenrith's transformation. Enchant creature. When, en when Kenrith's transformation is in the battlefield, draw a card. Loses all abilities. It's a green elk with base and power 3 3. Okay. So. That, like, is kind of situational. If I was gonna have tokens, like 1-1 one, one tokens, that would be good. That would be good enchantment for a token. What does Once Upon a Time do? Because I know, like, everybody's crazy about this card. <laughs> okay. This is a Robin Hood outfit. I just want everyone to know right now. If this spell is the first spell you cast this game, you may cast it without paying its mana cost. Oh, look at the top five cards of your library. You may reveal a creature or a land card from among them, put it in your hand, put the rest in the bottom of the random order. I like that, and I'm gonna put it in my deck. How about that? Um, <coughs> return to nature, destroy target artifact, destroy target enchantment, or exile target creature from a graveyard. There are a lot of artifacts in this set, and normally I would not I would personally not put a destroy artifact thing in my in my like sealed deck, but there are so many artifacts in this set. I think it might be worth it. Honestly. You think Kenra you think Kenra's transformation is good? You get to draw a card, it only costs two mana, and it makes your creature a 3-3, three, three, which is pretty pretty decent. Like it doesn't even have to be a token. It could be like anything that's less than a 3-3, three, three, obviously. I think I'm gonna put Return to Nature in there. Um, okay, I'll put Kenrith's Transformation in there. I need creatures. I need creatures is what I need. Um, I feel like I don't even have that many creatures. You can weaken a big opponent's creature. That's a good, that's a good idea two um okay let's look and see what we've got I, I don't have like any little creatures this is this is like not good oh wait a second I should put in you know what I bet I might have more that are like artifacts possibly uh I have inquisitive puppet so there's that I'll put that in there Put that in there. Um, okay, what is this? Yorvo, Lord of Garenbrig, enters the battlefield with four 1-1 one -one counters on it. Whenever, whenever another green creature enters the battlefield, put a 1-1 one -one counter on it. Okay, I'm putting that in my deck. That's good. Okay, I've got a wolf. Enters the battlefield, create a food token. Sure. Tall is a beanstalk. Enchanted creature gets plus three, plus three, and has reach. It is a giant in addition to its other type. That's pretty good. Um, Wicked Wolf. Okay, the four drop wolf is good. Add red, why? I don't want to. Uh, I don't really have that much. I don't really have that much in red. I mean, I have this thing. Each other non-human creature. Okay, wait a second. I need to see what lands I have too. I guess that would make a difference. Uh, what? Uh, okay. I guess I didn't get any like, are there no dual lands in this set? Are there no, are there no? 
Zuby, you are bound to jump on. Okay, that that is good. After I play my sealed event, Zuby, um, I will I will try to direct challenge you some some games. Okay, both of the wolves. Okay, I'm taking the red out. I agree. I can't I can't do three colors. I cannot do three colors. I think the wicked wolf is good too. It fights up to one target creature you don't control. That's good. Sacrifice of food. Put a one one counter. Okay, so I need to make sure I'm getting enough food tokens. Um, what about golden egg enters the battlefield, draw a card. No, I'm sorry. I don't want to do that. Um, sacrifice a creature, create a food token. Oh. I don't know about that. A hedge walker? Um... Do I do I have any colorless mana sources? It doesn't look like it. Do you have the black card that puts a creature from the graveyard to the top of the deck? Um, it's it's um, no, I don't. Uh, I do not. I have. Golden egg mana fixing? Golden, okay, let's see. Add one mana of any color. Okay, we can do that. And we get to draw a card when it enters the battlefield. So that's fine. Um, let's see. So, man, I don't have any small creatures. Like, I got three drop creatures. That's the smallest creature I have. Marley Pixie. Yeah, I do have a lot of cards that are, that are like expensive mana costs. I mean, as far as like mono mana colors go. Marleaf Pixie, like maybe I should see what blue I have. Mm. Mm, I don't. I don't have blue. I'm mean, gonna have a little bit, but like not anything worthwhile. Uh, the Paladin is great. Oh, five mana, though. If at least three green mana was spent to cast this spell. <gasps> okay, everybody, everybody, hold up. Hey, hey, can you hand me this kitten? Can you hand me this kitten? Okay, okay, here we go. Here we go. We're bringing in the kitten. We are bringing in the kitten. Hold still, hold still. Okay, this is Daisy, everybody. Here she is. Here she is with her crown. She's like, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing to me? Okay, I'll take it off. I'll take it off. Okay, that was it. That was our that was our debut. That was okay. I have cat hair in my mouth. I have cat hair in my mouth. Why isn't Mr. Kitten dressed as Captain Hook? Because I'm not Peter Pan. I'm not. Yes. Hi, Daisy. This is Daisy, my sweetheart. Um. Okay. It's not super aggro. It is slow. It is slow. What about this Resolute Rider? Um, hi there, sweetheart. Okay, what do we have? What do we have? What do we even have right now? We have nine creatures. I, that feels so low to me. Oh, you meant the Sheriff of Nottingham. Yeah, that or Little John or Little John. Yes, for sure. Hi, sweetheart. 
Uh, yeah, okay. Four black is hard. I know, I know, right? Uh, oh, oh, this wants me to put sleeves on my deck. Why can't I click out of this? Okay, I got it, I got it. Okay, I guess we'll put this paladin in here. Sure. I have three of them? Well, I'm just gonna put one because I'm terrified. Uh, okay. So. Yeah, my curve is too low. I do need low drop creatures. It's true, but I just don't have any. I'm gonna have to go into a different color because I don't have any. Okay, let's look at white. I don't have a lot in white either. Like, I have this one creature. A youthful knight. Okay, let's look. At, wait, did we look at red already? Um, I have this one. No, I have this one. Ugh. I don't like any of these. Okay, my deck is gonna be really bad. Honestly. <sighs> okay. So, uh, we, okay, what about this giant opportunity? You may sacrifice two food tokens. If you do, create a seven seven green giant creature token. Otherwise, create three food tokens. Do I have a way to get food tokens? Do I have ways to get food tokens? Um, study can provide solutions to millions of questions I have that. It cannot stop your mom from asking millions of questions about your life. With the um, study app, you can send photos of your most complicated count questions and get personalized no. help really fast. You cannot send photos of that mystery meat that's been festering since freshman year. Uh, Sacrifice on Honestly, like, I don't have black creatures. Honestly, I don't. Okay, I'll put the three drop artifact. I need that. And hopefully I can spend three mana of the same color to give it a counter. And... You forget if the troll makes food. Um, yeah. So, the troll, if you cast it from your hand, you create three food tokens. But that's going to be hard to cast. That is going to be real tough to cast. Um, sacrifice a food token. Okay, the wolf, yes, the wolf creates a food token. Uh, no. Uh, this creates a food token. Bake into a pie. Um, when tempting witch, I have two tempting witches. They create food tokens. Okay. Um, drop for one, drops for one man, dose three damage. What? Cauldron is great. Oh, okay. Yeah, cauldron would be good. Cauld I oh wait, that was witch's oven. Scalding cauldron is good. I agree. Um, the specter with adventure. Oh, the adventure is good. You know, I didn't even look at that because I was just paying attention to how expensive the creature was. Target opponent discards two cards. That's discarding is good. Is really good and limited because. You don't have cards to play. So, yeah, let's put this in for the discard. Let's put this in for the discard. You, okay. Uh, yes, bake into a pie. I'd, you'd play both cauldrons? Okay, well, then we'll do both cauldrons. Um, okay, so we're at 39 out of 40. So, should I put some extra mana in here? Um, instead, to just, like, make up for it? Okay, let's see where we are. Our curve is not good. Our curve is really not good. But honestly, it's the best we're gonna get. I I mean, I thought when we opened those packs, we had like a good little thing here, but man, that this is rough for sure. 
Okay, we've got 12 creatures now. I feel a little bit better about that. Um, I guess I'll put in an extra swamp. Let's do that. That puts us at 40. So we have a total of 7, 8, 9, 17, 19 lands. What? I have a lot of like, um, I have a lot of cards that are like really hard cast with like the three black and the three green. Yeah, I know. Uh, which oven is good? Yes. Another, another paladin? Another paladin? It's expensive though. Okay, let's do it. We're going with 41. Okay, that's it. We're done. We're doing it. We're playing this deck. If it sucks, then it sucks, and that's okay. But we're doing it. You know what? We're doing it. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. Um, Throne of Veldrain. We are doing it. We, we built a deck. It's a slow deck, and I don't like that, and I'm not good at playing that, but here we go. We are hoping for um, an event that's like 7-0 because it could happen. Mm-hmm. Here we go. Okay, here we go. This is fine. Cauldron, witch, bake into a pot. You know what? This is good. We're going to keep it. Oh, and look, here's Karen. Karen's here. Karen loves us. Here we go. We're going to throw out our scalding cauldron first thing. We got this. I'm going to say hi to my opponent. Hi there, Sayer Bong. <laughs> That's their name, okay? I'm not, I'm, oh, they said hello to me. Okay, I love my fox. Oh, look, we got, we got Ayara, so we need more swamps because we can't cast her right now. So that kind of sucks. Okay, we're getting our witch out and we're getting a boon token. We're okay. We are okay. The Tempting Witch has like these arms coming. I feel like that was super mean. Scorching Dragonfire? Like why? Sarah Bob, why did you do this? Okay. You know what? Okay, we can play this or we can play this. Look at the top five cards of your library. You may reveal a creature or land from among them, put it into your hand. Okay, let's, should we do that and look for our black so we can play um, Aara? Let's do that. We're gonna do it. We're looking for a black. Son of, oh. Um, I'm gonna take this forest. Okay, well, I'm, I'm super mad. We're just gonna pass. Uh, okay, so here we go. It's gonna be fine. Next turn, oh, what's this? What's happening? Okay, they're playing their creature, so it's fine. They're equipping their creature. They're putting a crystal slipper on this sword master. I find that hilarious. Why not the food land? I don't know. I thought, I don't, I, it, I didn't have the three forests. It couldn't have entered with a food token. Cause I, I just took this forest instead of that one. So that one would have entered tapped. Oh, we got it. 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 Okay. We got it. We got it. You gain one life. Draw a card. Okay, we could do this. Enters with a 1-1 one, one counter. Or we could do that. Thoughts? What I think we should do. Haste and lifelink. Okay, let's, let's kill this creature. Let's do it. Okay, we're okay. We're okay. We're getting lots of food tokens. That's good. Our deck is slow. We know that. But it's gonna be... They have a Sir Conrad. <gasps> Hold up. What is this? If at least three green mana. I don't have three green mana. 
Oh wait, oh, yes I do. Enters with a counter on it. Can't be blocked with creatures with power with two or less. Okay, that's okay. Uh, or this, or this. Um, okay, I'm gonna play this one. Where should I play the paladin? Uh, I'm gonna play this one. I'm gonna play this one. Okay, I'm gonna pay four, five, one, two, three, four, five. Cause I wanna pay at least three green mana. Okay, 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 okay. We baked that creature into a pie. We baked the smitten sword master into a pie. That's right. Oh, the paladin, oh, I messed up. I put, oh, oh wait, I did play a paladin, but also this is a paladin. <gasps> there are multiple paladins. They are looking at my paladin. Don't kill my, don't kill my gear and bring paladin. Mm -mm. Don't kill it. This seems like a trap. Um, should I not, should I block it or not? Should I block it or not? Should I kill? Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna block it. No! That was a trap and I fell for it. Ugh. Okay. Um, I can scry with this. Okay, I'm gonna get this out. I'm gonna get this out. And I'm going to... Um, I'm gonna put this out. Oh, okay. I think we should keep this and cast the sorcery. I think we should keep this. I think we should keep this. Um, Cerebon does play dirty. I know, right? Okay, Doug, thank you for hanging out. You going back to work? That is totally fine. Um, we're gonna, should I? No, I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna next. I'm just gonna end turn. Uh, okay. Oh. Okay. Bell of the Brawl, oof, not good. Not good. Um, okay. Oh no, they're equipping it! Okay, it's okay. It's okay. Ah, oh, dang. Um, so I can resolve this. Pass to blockers. I will block this one. So, okay, so if I use my Inquisitive Puppet's ability right now, it will absorb the damage, correct? It, it will absorb the damage, right? I think. I think this, I think this is how it'll work. Right. Okay, so Conrad didn't do anything. Got it. Got it. Should I sacrifice a food token and gain some life? Uh, sacrifice this artifact. I mean, I guess I'm going to. This might be dumb, but I'm getting like low. Ish, not ish, but yeah. Okay, whatever. Oh no, I did it. Oops, I did it, I did it. Target opponent discards two cards. Okay, we're doing this right now. They only have two cards, so this is good. This is good. Uh, okay. 
They're thinking they don't want to get rid of those cards, do they? Sarah Bong does not want... Wait, what just happened? Oh no, this is happening. This... Oh, it's doing damage to me! Uh-oh. Okay, I don't want to attack because then I just like leave myself open. Um, okay, I don't, I don't want to attack. No attacks. Um, okay, we're not ending turn. Yikes, I don't, I don't know about this game. I don't know about this game. My opponent has a good deck, don't they? Okay. Uh, Karen, Karen is cheering us on. Karen is here, cheering us on. Oh no, return target creature from your graveyard to your hand. Dang. Ugh. This, this Sir Conrad is doing so much damage to me. Okay, it's fine. Order of Midnight. Oh. Yeah, they... Um, okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to chomp block Sir Conrad. I could kill their Bell of the Brawl. I don't want to do that. I really don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. <laughs> Oh, okay. Here we go. Um, uh, no! They're doing more damage to me! I need to leave up some mana to do my cauldron thing. What's this? Draw a card. Loses all abilities. Oh! <gasps> Should I do this to one of their creatures? Should I do this to Sir Conrad? Or I could cast the I could cast the the Lockwain Paladin. Uh, I could totally do that, and then it stops doing damage to me. I'm gonna do it. I'm. This might be so sketchville, but I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. If I have enough mana, I can cauldron it and kill it. Oh, oh my goodness. What are they doing? What are they doing? I'm drawing a card. Oh, this is good. This is so good. I'm gonna I'm gonna scalding cauldron them. Where should I kill the Bell of the Brawl? Mm. Haste and menace. I guess I'll kill Sir Conrad. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Okay, it's fine. I'm so scared. Okay, I'm not gonna attack with this. No attacks. Oh. Okay, this menace creature, I maybe should have killed this menace creature. Or their flyer. Like, I can't block that. Uh, uh-oh. They're doing some damage to me. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay. This is going badly. Oh, dang. I feel like none of this even matters, so I might as well chump block. Well, I'm not chump blocking. I actually will kill. I'll kill their creature. Wait, I can't block it. It has menace! Shoot! Okay. Oh! That was it! Ah, oh, dang. 
I forgot their I forgot their bell of the brawl gave another creature the plus one, so they were gonna do the damage. Ooh, okay. They they had a really good deck for sure. Um, but I don't think my deck was bad. It's just it is slow. It is slow. So let's just try it again. Let's just try it again. It's gonna be fine. We're going to try it again. They did. They had a really good deck. And I'm happy for them. You know what? That's great. They had a good deck. That is lovely. Robin Hood sure would like some salt. What? I don't even understand what that means. What? Robin Hood sure would like some salt. Okay, sure, whatever, it's fine. Where did my kitty cat go? She left me. She was embarrassed because I put the costume on her and she didn't like it. Wow, this cue is just taking some time. Okay, here it goes, here it goes. We are playing an opponent called No Verb. I don't know what that means. Okay, here we go. Swap forest, forest. Uh, okay, 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 okay. <gasps> I can cast once upon a time the first spell I cast. Hey, Godric Marwick. Godric Marwick. I think I'm saying that right. Thanks for coming back. And card sphere, I just don't understand. I just don't understand what you've said. It doesn't make sense. I'm just saying, it doesn't make sense. Okay, Karen is here supporting us, um, hanging out. Oh, Godric, it's okay. It's totally fine. I mean, I totally understand. Uh, that's okay. Resolve, I guess. Should I play this before it's my turn? I guess I will. I don't know. That seems okay. You know what? I'll do it. It's fine. Uh I don't know. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I'm just gonna take that. It's kind of expensive. Oh, play it now, <laughs> okay. Okay, I did it, I did it. I played it now, I played it now. Okay, we're playing a swamp and we'll go ahead and put our cauldron out there. Okay, my opponent has a cauldron too, so there's that. Um, You know what, I didn't say hi to my opponent, so I'm going to say hello. Oh, <gasps> they have a flutter fox. It's so cute. Yes, it is. It is so cute. Um, yeah, I don't want to put my Lash of Thorns on their creature, so I'm just going to pass. There's that. Uh, okay. Nope, we don't want to put our Lash of Thorns on their creature. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm. Okay. Their little fox is flying. Oh no, they have multiple flutter foxes. So, okay. It's fine. We have a lot of land here. We have a lot of land. That's okay. Uh, okay, it's fine. We've got some tempting witches. We need a lot of land because our deck is slow and has big creatures, so it's fine. We need it. Don't look at my tempting witch. Don't. <gasps> Ooh, our opponent is playing three colors. Wow. Oh, yikes. Oh no, okay. We are getting smashed by their flyers. So there's that. What's that? Stone Coil Serpent? Okay, that's a thing. 
Okay, so I could attack and give my creature, let's see, I could give my witch death touch and kill their thing. Or I could, hmm, okay, I could play another witch and another cauldron. I could sacrifice their cauldron and deal three damage to her creature. I maybe should do that because of these flyers. Um, okay, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do the cauldron and get rid of one of their flyers. And then I'll save my witch for a blocker. And if they attack with this thing, I'll use the Lash of Thorns on it on their turn. That's what I'll do. Because I'm gonna pass. Ooh, that's a good thing. Yes, I have the food token. Uh, pass. Okay. So I'm going to pass. I'm gonna block this. I'm going to put the Lash of Thorns on it. Okay. We're doing it. We're giving it Death Touch. We're killing their serpent. Ah! Oh! <laughs> okay. So there's that. That thing is dead. Cool. So I think we're pretty much dead here. I can't play this with counters on it. Um, I can get rid of their fox with my cauldron, but that would be the only thing I could do. I guess I'll play this. Ugh. Uh, have I thought about making another Eldrain food video? This time making food instead of receiving it? No, I haven't thought about that. No, I haven't, but that's a good idea. I could maybe try that. Ugh, okay. I'm gonna block, I'm gonna block their serpent, but I'm going to assume they have some sort of trick they don't. Okay, that's fine. Uh, ooh, lonesome unicorn. Okay, um, let's see. I can, what can I do here? What can I do? I could kill their flutter fox. I could cast the I could cast the scolding cauldron, and then kill their flutter fox. Um, I guess I'll maybe do that. I don't have a lot of options. Oh wait, why couldn't I do that? Why can't I do this? Um, why can't I do that? Why can't I do that? Deals five damage to target creature with flying? Oh, it doesn't have flying. Oh, wow. It doesn't have flying right now. Dang. Okay. Well, that sucks. Um, okay. They're doing some damage to me. Uh, not a griffin. Okay, now I can kill their creature with flying. That will that will cost all my mana. Almost all my mana. Can't cast that. Okay, I'll do this. I'll kill their griffin. I got another food token. Okay, so I could do that and gain some life. I could gain three life, or I could... <coughs> I cast my witch. I'll cast my witch, because it can block their creature and create another food token. It can block their creature without dying. Okay. Now what? They, what if they have something to kill my witch? They might. I need a lot more green mana to be able to cast this troll. I'm going to assume they have something. Oh, they don't. Or do they? Bye. Okay. Uh, 
Uh, okay. What are they gonna do? Oh, okay. <gasps> okay, we got another forest. Still not enough to cast our Fasting Troll King. That sucks. Uh, but we can do this. And let's see. We can also sacrifice a food token and gain. I think we can do this and sacrifice a food token. Oh, my arena just crashed again. At least I have a lot of practice on like opening it up real fast. Oh my goodness. Okay, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Wow. This thing, I'm telling you what. Come on. Our opponent, no verb, is waiting. Uh, okay. Now what are we doing? Next to combat. Next to attackers. Sacrifice a food token. Target player loses three life. Ugh. I'm not attacking. I think I can, okay, end turn. <coughs> I will try to gain life, I guess I'll try to gain life on their turn. Pass. What does this do? Double strike, ugh. So they'll kill anything that blocks it. They're not attacking. Oh, they are casting their lonesome unicorn. They're casting their Hushbringer. Oh no. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna sacrifice one of my food tokens and get some life. It's all I've got. It's all I've got. <gasps> what is this? This is not going to keep me alive, but I'm going to cast it anyways. Sacrifice a food, target player loses three life. I don't wanna do that. Um. Okay, I'm just gonna pass. I'm gonna pass, okay. We're okay right now. I need one more green and then I can cast the troll. One more green. Okay, they're gonna hit me with this little one one, or one two. Does it have lifelink? Ugh, it does. And they've already got like so much life. Okay, I'll sacrifice another one, I guess. Ugh. Are you evil for Loki liking Hushbringer? Yes, you are. <laughs> yes, you are. Okay, I can cast this. This is fine. Okay, I'll use adamant. If at least three grana, uh, three gr grana, <laughs> green mana. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. It's entering with a counter. That's good. <gasps> we might be okay. Um, No attacks. Okay. Okay, we're we're sort of like, we're okay right now. We're sort of coming even, even though we got pretty low. Hushbringer, okay. Creatures entering the battlefield or dying don't cause abilities to trigger. Like, it's good. Oh no, this is not good. It, it's good if you're playing it. It's bad if you're playing against it. Ugh. We've got to find a way to kill that thing. Wicked wolf. I found a way to kill it. Ah! OMG, this is perfect. Wait. It fights up to one target creature you don't control. Why didn't it do that? Wait a second, why? Why, why, why? Why though? I, 
I don't understand. I'm not attacking because I'm terrified. Oh, that's why. The Hush Oh, no. Oh, no. That's why. I'm so sad right now. Oh, ho, ho. they're going to just kill me with this stupid thing. With the check study app, you can send photos of your most complicated count questions and get personalized help really fast. You can oh no, I'm dead. I'm dead. Basically, I'm 100% dead. It's everything you need to succeed in school. Well, almost. Oh, damn. Spotify and get five dollars off your first month. Check a smarter way to. Okay, this is like not what I need. Wait a second. Does this let me does this let me play my Squarespace or upload a menu of cocktails made with an ounce of something you can't pronounce? Okay, but this doesn't keep me alive. This doesn't keep me alive. Oh no. Whatever you drink, a website makes it real. Make it. Oh, the hush bringer. It's killing me. I don't get my I'm so sad. Which would also be pretty amazing. It's so amazing that millions of people a year are getting their cash back matched. You just can't get it. I'm so sad right now. with all except for this and this because I'm dead if you call it alive ain't it sounds more positive than dead that's true yep I'm alive ain't for sure dang okay well you know what Whatever. Uh. Oh, wait a second. I got some life back. Did I get some life back? What happened? How am I at eight? I was... Did I have lifelink? I could have sworn I was at five and they were gonna just kill me. Oh, dang. Yeah, I can't, I can't block their flyers. Oh no, no verb has got me, I'm sure of it. Um, okay, a freaking swamp. I mean, I could sacrifice a food token and gain life. This has vigilance and trample. Um. I don't. I don't think I can do anything to come back from this. I'm gonna attack with these two. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I'm so dead. Ah, oh, they're creating knights. It's evil. No, they're giving their stuff. They're giving their creatures buffs. Oh no! Oh no, they're double blocking. They're double blocking my troll. Okay, thanks, Godric Marwick. Thank you so much for hanging out. I really appreciate it. Have a good night. Bye. 
Unfortunately, I am so, 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 so dead. Um. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna try to stay alive. I'm gonna try to stay alive. Oh my goodness. Uh, what can I do? Okay, I have to block something because like, um, oh man. Okay, I'll double block this. Wait a second. This has double strike. Okay, I can't kill that thing. Um, so I'll just block that with that actually um okay and i'm gonna take five Ugh. and they get lifelink from the dang hush bringer and apparently they're getting s more creatures Oh, I guess this is in my hand because I could sacrifice three food tokens and return it from my graveyard to the battlefield. Except that I can't. Because I have no food tokens. Oh, shoot. All right, well, good game. I'm dead. My fox is mad. Karen, Karen's mad at no verb. <laughs> yeah, I'm dead. I tried to stay alive as long as I could. I think my deck sucks. Oh man. I think. I think my deck sucks. You know what? It's okay. It's okay. We've got two losses. So I think we, we can only get one more loss. We have two losses and zero wins. So <laughs> yikes. Okay, it's fine. We're gonna try again, and it's gonna be fine. The food token kept me alive for a long time, for sure. It didn't keep me alive in the end. Oh, guess who's back? Daisy's back. She wants to put her costume on again. Come back. Come back. She doesn't want to put her costume on. She hates her costume. Hold on. Here she is. Do you want to put your costume on again so that we match? Oh, three swamps. Yikes, there's that. But we can, we can cast a Yara. But she's no good without other black creatures, which we don't have. Ooh, this is this is a total yikes hand. I think I have to mulligan. I really think I have to mulligan. Okay. Swamp Force for it. Cauldron. The Paladin. Okay. Oh. Okay, we're gonna keep this. And I'm going to get rid of. Should I get rid of this wolf or this paladin? Um. I like Menace, but I think I'm going to get rid of this one. I mean, this is Sketchville. I'm just ha I'm just hoping that my opponent has a flyer. Uh, okay, I'm going to say, hello. Oh, look, they have a flyer. Wait, that's not a flyer. <laughs> Oops. Which is Cottage? If you have three or more swamps, which I don't, and I'm not going to have anytime soon. Uh, so I'm gonna play this and my cauldron. Oh goodness, okay, it's fine. You know what? Oh, they're playing red and white. They're playing Boros and they have recto sleeves on their deck. Oh, yikes. Oh. Okay, my deck. Okay, should I play the Witch's Cottage? Uh, yeah, because I can't do anything else. 
Okay. I think my deck is just too slow for limited, honestly. Like, you have to anticipate fast play. And I think my deck is just too slow. Ooh, a jousting dummy. Okay. Well, they've got three creatures out and I have none. So. Yikes, big yikes. Uh, okay, they have no flyers. And I can't do anything. This may be our third loss here, folks. I could go ahead and like hurt something. Um, but I'll just wait. I'll just wait. I'll just wait until their turn and see what they're gonna play. I may be able to get rid of something bigger if they cast something even bigger. Ooh, they're playing a Mardu deck. How fun. I love that combination. Mardu is probably one of my favorite combinations. Um, so I think I'm gonna cauldron. I'm going to cauldron one of their creatures. Um, and I guess I'll do it. What is this? This is a four four. I guess I'll do it to this one. Because they can pay they can pay the thing to give it, make it a 3-1. So, I'll get rid of that one. Ooh, a, a Lockwain Paladin. Okay, here we go. We're fine. We are going to be okay. Uh, ooh, I can bake into a pie. Ooh, should I do that to their creature? Or, hmm, okay, hmm. Doug, the sealed run is not going well. I've lost two games and one zero. So I'm I'm going to bake into a pie their paladin, I think. It's the the deck the my deck is okay, but it is slow. And it's it's been rough. My previous game was I mean it was okay. I tried to stay alive as long as I could. And I did stay alive for a while, but they got me in the end. Uh, okay, so let's play a swamp and then we'll hope for like a forest next turn. Um, okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna cast my wolf. I'll create another food token. Okay good this is good this is fine and I have lash of thorns well I really don't need that against any of their creatures okay so that's okay I think we're okay right now we're just gonna hope they have really bad draws for the rest of the game yeah the cards are good my deck is not bad, it's just, it, it's, it's just like legitimately slow. And I think in most limited formats, like, people try to build fast decks. Okay, they're tapping my creature. Okay. I can't do anything about that. They're attacking me for three. And we're taking some damage. We are down to nine. We're down to nine. Okay. Uh, wow. Ooh, what's this? Did we start our artifact enchantment? Oh my, what's happening? Okay, hold up. I can kill their flyer for two. The gingerbread cabin. Hmm. Destroy target artifact, enchantment, or exile. I guess I can get rid of that. Would it, I don't know if that's worth it. Okay, so I'm definitely gonna get rid of their flyer. Okay, that we're definitely doing. Um, I can attack with my with my thingy, my Bob, my wolf. Add one man of any color, or you gain three life. Hmm. 
I just don't think that my return to nature is worth killing their golden egg. Uh... Maybe I should not attack. Well, it's too late. You know what? It's too late. Okay. Eek. Okay, I have my food tokens to get, I have some food, I have my food tokens to get some life. Okay, all they're doing is attacking me. For three. Oh, for four. Yikes. Oh God. For five. Wait a second. I could get rid of their jousting dummies with this. I should have done that. I should have done that! Ben1976, you're so right! I'm an idiot! I'm an absolute idiot. Okay, I'm gonna sacrifice a food token and get some life back first. Oh, dang. I'm like, that was so dumb. Okay, I'm just gonna play this because I'm not getting another green. I'm not getting another green. Look at the top five cards of your library. You may reveal a creature or land and put it into your hand. Okay. I can play both Once Upon a Time and Return to Nature. So I'll get rid of their jousting dummy. Uh, I'm gonna destroy their jousting dummy. Okay, that's good. Okay, and now I'm gonna once upon a time. I don't need a land, so I'll look for a creature. Oh, this is good. Do I have enough mana to cast that? One, two, three, four, five, six, no. But, target opponent discards two cards. That might be good. Next, um. I'm going to, I'm just gonna not attack. I'm going to not attack. I have a hard time not attacking. I love attacking. Um, okay. What's that about? Sorcerer's Broom. Okay. Okay. My turn. Ooh, Tempting Witch, that's good. Okay, this is going well. Okay, they only have one card. So I'm gonna hold on to that. I'm gonna hold on to that. Can I do both? No, I can't. So I'm gonna play my Tempting Witch because she can kill both of their creatures and I get another food token. Um, and I guess I'll attack with my wolf this time. I'm going to attack with my wolf. And let's see if they have any sort of trick. Even... Uh, what is happening? Create a token that's a copy? Okay. Okay. Wait a second. Can I play Lash of Thorns? Yes, I can. So my so my wolf won't die. Yes. Oh yes. Oh yes. My wolf is alive. Should I gain some life? I think I will. I'm gonna sacrifice a food. Oh, that was my turn. I guess I could have waited. That was dumb. I thought it was their turn. Oh, no! Shoot. Okay. Oh, what's this? Uh, okay, we need to... Oh, they don't have any cards now. 
Okay, okay, okay. I'll play my paladin. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. And I'll attack with my wolf. They'll either sacrifice their flyer. <gasps> they didn't! They didn't! Okay, so they're going to hit me with their flyer. Like, I can't prevent that. They did not attack. Okay. They don't have... Hmm. Okay. Okay, this thing doesn't have flying. But if defending player has two or fewer cards in hand, it does gain flying? Hmm, so I'm gonna cast this creature. I'm gonna cast this creature. Okay, and I'm gonna attack with all. <gasps> I'm gonna attack with all. I'm going to attack with all. <gasps> they took it. They didn't even chump block with their little one one. I mean, they could have like not blocked with their flyer, but they could have chomped block, chomp. What happened? What just happened? Oh, they wanted to do some damage to me? Okay. Oh, <gasps> okay, this is good. Am I gonna kill them? Is that what's happening here? They can block all my creatures. Like, why did they just say good? Oh. This one can't be blocked by creatures with power two or less. <gasps> Yay! I won! Wow, I won a game! Hi there, Wizard Oak. How's it going? How's your early access event going? Mine is going very well, and I'm having a lot of fun. Um, my seal draft is like real rocky. I've lost two games. I just won that one. So we're going to play another one and see how it goes. I don't know. It's Sketchville for sure. Uh, okay, so let's see. Swamp Forest Forest. Um, okay, 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 I'll keep it. It's, it's fine. I'm gonna keep it. I'm scared to not keep it, honestly. Um, <laughs> seven and two, let's go. Yeah, yeah, sure. Let's do it. Um, I'm gonna play the puppet. And that way I'll get to scry one. Um, do I want to keep this forest? Not really. I want something else. Okay. We're getting rid of that. I'm not going to... I can't attack with this thing. Oh, I can exile and create a 1-1. One, one. Human! You're taking a break. You get burned out during your stream. It... Yeah, I get that for sure. Uh, okay. Let's see. I'm, I drew another forest, so I'm really glad I, I'm, I'm really glad I scried that forest to the bottom of my deck. Uh, okay. Um, I'm just going to pass turn. And we'll see what our opponent's gonna do. Oh look, they have the they have the Nissa alternate art sleeves on their deck. It's so cute. Wait a second. Hey, that seems unnecessary. You can't wait to play some seals on Thursday. Well, hopefully you do better than I have. I really love limited, but I I don't like sealed. Like, 
I like to play a booster draft, but sealed is not my favorite thing to do, like, at all. Not at all. Um, we are just gonna pass. I mean, I, I guess I could, like, sacrifice this to create a human, but I don't know if I should wait or not. Yeah, I get it. Sometimes it's a lot to play for a long time, especially streaming, because you have to, like, talk the whole time and be interactive. Uh, we're sure. We'll resolve that. Um, you're looking for some ideas for decks? Yeah, what kind? Um, let's see. Uh, 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 uh. Should I sacrifice this and make a 1-1? One, one? No, I won't. Ooh. Oh, I could enchant it. Okay, I'm gonna play forest. Not Pinocchio, never sack Pinocchio. <laughs> okay, I won't. Oh, sorry for suggesting it. Okay, I'm going to transform my puppet. How about that? Ooh, once upon a time, that's good. Okay, should I attack with my puppet and Lash of Thorns them? I think I'm going to. I'm going to try and trick them. They're not blocking. <gasps> they knew it was a trick! That's fine. I'm gonna once upon a time them now. Uh, I'll take... Ooh. Um, my Tempting Witch has been really good, though. Um, I'm gonna take this one. Oh, man, I don't have the mana to pay for it! I didn't even think about that! Oh, dang! Shoot! I only have one swamp. Okay, that was so dumb. Uh, yeah, he's an elk boy now. Totally an elk boy. That's okay, Ben1976. Thank you for hanging out, though. I really appreciate it. Really appreciate it. Okay, I can't... Oh, I can't attack with that. Oh, boy. This is bad. Yeah, this is not good. Uh... Okay, I'm just gonna pass. Yikes. Mardu Knight and Is It? Oh, I played against an Is It deck earlier and it was pretty good. I'm, I think, I think it destroyed me if I remember correctly. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was rough. It was rough for sure. <laughs> for sure. Um, okay, so if our opponent attacks, we can kill something with our Lash of Thorns. Oh my god. Oh, damn. This is not good. Like, it's not good at all. Um, okay. So they gave one of their... They gave one of their knights menace? Is that what happened? Uh, okay, so I guess I'll block this. I guess I'll block this and then I'll Lash of Thorns it. Ah! Oh my goodness. Ugh. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Yikes. Okay, we can cast this. We can cast this. That's okay. That's good. We're fine. 
block one of their creatures. <laughs> and I can cast another one next turn, so that's good. Okay, here we go. What are they gonna do? What is Snail Arg gonna do? Because that's my opponent's name, Snail Arg. <laughs> Okay. I'm so scared. Um, is this a trap? I'm gonna block it. Was this a trap? It wasn't. That was strange. Okay, I guess I'll play my other one. Okay, so it can't be blocked by creatures with power two or less. So, I'm going to attack with it. Oh, they just took it. They just took it. Royal Scions and is it? Oh, I don't even know what that is. Tormenting voice at instant speed? That does seem good. A little bit too good, if you ask me. Nobody wants that at instant speed. That's just OP. Okay, Snail Arg, what you gonna do? Oh no! Inspiring veteran? That's so good! Rimrock Knight can't block. Um, okay, so I guess I'll kill. This has trample. This has double strike. Okay, so I guess I'll block this one. Yikes, I'm down to three. Oh no. Uh, what's this? Target opponent discards two cards. They have no cards. Oh, yikes. Okay, this is pretty much my only option. I mean, I guess I could go ahead and um, sacrifice it and get some life back. Uh, I could do 10 damage to them and they can't, they can't block, they can't block any of my creatures. But then I would only have one blocker up. So I just have to pass. I just have to pass. Oh, yikes. I think I might be dead, like, no matter what. Artifact enchantment, like, that's not helping me. Okay, so can I stay alive? Okay, I'll chump block this. Uh, and then I'll block this. Three, four, five, six, oh, okay. Yeah, so I'm pretty much dead no matter what. I'm pretty much dead no matter what. Yikes! Ah, okay. Well, so let's be honest, my sealed deck sucked. Um, it just did. It's okay though, you know what? It happens, it totally happens. So that was my three losses, three losses and one win. That's not, not very good, not very good. Let's open our packs and see what we got. Um, the Throne of Eldraine packs. Oh, you know, I have every card, so it's only gonna give me, it's only gonna give me Mythic Wild cards. So that's not any fun. Okay, let's actually do a giveaway. So we're gonna open our giveaway right now. Give away open. Okay, if you want to be in my giveaway, type a number in chat between one and 20, and I will roll a 20 sided die, and whoever gets the closest will win the giveaway. So, Go ahead and type it in the chat if you want to be in my giveaway. 
problems and get personalized. You can win a code for Arena for 1000 Throne of Eldraine Mastery Pass XP, or if you're not going to get the Throne of Eldraine Mastery Pass, then I will open a random booster pack and you will win the rare inside the booster pack. So, type your number into chat and I will roll the die in just a moment. And also, just so you know, you can only win one code, one arena code per account. So if you've already won a code and you win another giveaway, then you'll win a rare card for sure. So yeah, they've set it up so the codes are only one per account, which is whatever. You can, you can still enter the giveaway and all that, but you won't be able to, to use another code on your account. So I'll leave the giveaway open for another minute or so. And I'll open these packs. Uh, ooh, Wicked Guardian. I kind of like that card. I don't think I have any decks with it in there, though. More gems. The Mad Rider seems really cool. Um, for a rat's deck. I think that would be fun. To play, for sure. I think it's interesting. I think a rat's deck would be would be really fun. Oh, and this was an M20 pack. So I'm gonna leave my giveaway open for just a few more moments. And then we will determine our winner. Um, also, if you win the giveaway and you choose a booster pack, I'll send you the rare card out of the booster pack and also a card sphere sticker because card sphere is the best and you should check out their website cardsphere.com for buying and selling your magic cards that's where i buy and sell my cards i think it's great um yeah the new rat rare the piper is seems really awesome I really need to look up and see if somebody has built a deck of that and play it later today. Because that one looks like a lot of fun. Yeah, no foils. You don't win the foil, just the rare, sorry. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and close my giveaway. Close giveaway. Okay, and I'm going to roll the die. Here we go. We are rolling the die to see who wins. <laughs> We rolled a 16. Okay. So it looks like Dougie Fresh, you win our giveaway with a 15. Congratulations. Would you like the arena code for 1000 Throne of Eldrin XP? Or would you like the rare out of one of these random booster packs? Let me know. If you want the rare out of the booster pack, I will open it right now and we'll all see what it is. Congratulations, Doug. What prize would you like? Tell me. There's a delay in the stream. So, streamer's choice, you choose. Well, I would really like to open a pack. So I'm going to pick an M20 pack and you get to win the rare in this pack. And if it's Soren, I'm gonna be real, 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 real upset. But let's open it up. Let's open it up and see what's in here. And you will win the rare in the pack. What is it? Here we go, M20. I think M20 was such a great set and I really, really, really love it. Okay, here we go. We've got our commons, our regular old commons. For uncommon, we have Imperium Eagle, Rule of Law, Tonebound Lich, and our rare is actually a mythic rare 
Cavalier of Dawn. There you have it. Doug, you win the Cavalier of Dawn. Congratulations. That's a pretty good card. So, um, if you will reach out to me and send me your address, I will send this card out to you this week. And also, a sweet card sphere sticker. So, good for you, Doug. Um, I am actually going to take a break and um, eat a little bite of dinner and chill for a little bit. Um, and then I'm gonna come back in probably about an hour and play some more arena. So thank you all so much for hanging out this afternoon. If you wanna come back later, I'll be doing more giveaways. I'll be doing the same giveaways I was doing just now. And I uh, hope you all have a great rest of the day and I hope to see you in a little bit. See you in about an hour. Okay, bye. Wait. Let me send you over to another channel that's live. Let me give you, let me do a little raid. Um, I'll send you over to, uh, I'll send you over to Lady Lavinia's. So go check out her stream and I will see you all in just a little bit. And thank you President's Choice Coffee for the follow. Okay, see you in about an hour. Bye, everyone. stuff in El Bring that I want to see. Some stuff. I would like Once Upon a Times. Three is fine. 